In Flip Over Frog, you are looking to help your brightly coloured frog friends take control of your own little corner of the rainforest. Cleverly placing frogs on the game board will flip adjacent tiles, hiding some frogs and revealing others. At the end of the game, the player with the most frogs face up of their colour is the winner. Plan ahead, watch out for snakes and flip your way to victory. To set up, Place the game board where all players can reach. Place the round frog tokens face down and shuffle them. Each player should then randomly pick one and secretly check to find out their colour. Set it face down and place any remaining tokens back in the box. You should not let any player see your coloured frog. To win, you must have the most frogs of your colour face up on the board at the end of the game. Shuffle the square tiles together and form a face down stack. Each player then draws three tiles from the stack and keeps them secret. The most brightly dressed player goes first. The rules to flip over frog are delightfully straightforward. Every turn you must do the following three things. Number one, you must play a tile to a viable space. Number two, you must resolve the effect of the tile. There are two types of tile, frogs and snakes. A frog tile can be played either on any empty space on the game board or on top of any face down tile. It cannot be played on a face up tile. When a frog tile is played, flip over any adjacent tiles in the direction of the four arrows. If a tile is stacked on another, both tiles are flipped together. Only the newly placed tile causes other tiles to flip. A snake tile removes a frog tile from the game. A snake tile may only be played on top of a face-up frog. Both the face-up frog and the snake tile are then discarded. And if played on a stack of two tiles, only the face-up frog tile is removed. Step 3 is to draw a new tile from the deck, refilling your hand to three tiles. If no tiles remain, you can skip this step. The game ends immediately when either all tiles have been played or the board is full with 16 face-up frog tiles. Each player then reveals their round frog token, and the player who has the most face-up frog tiles of their colour on the board is the winner. To make sure you've got how to play Flip Over Frog, here's a gameplay example. Player 1 plays a red frog tile onto an empty space. There are no tiles to flip. Player 2 plays a blue frog tile, and the arrows from this cause the red frog tile to flip. Player 3 plays a green frog tile on top of the face down tile. The arrows point to empty spaces, so nothing flips. Player 4 plays a yellow frog tile, and the arrows from this cause the blue frog tile to flip. The arrows also cause the stack of two tiles to flip, revealing the red frog. Player 1 plays the snake tile on the red frog tile. The red frog tile and the snake tile are discarded, and the game continues. If you have any questions, you can get in touch with us via our Twitter, on the game's BGG page, or in the comments below the YouTube video. Thank you for watching, and we hope you enjoy playing the game.